He does. He doesn't drop. <laughs> Tip is up, and once and now he can't get the ball. Jordan Tyson wins the tip, and we're underway. Polsley gets it down low to Denzel. Denzel, one step inside. Jump hook is good. And the Bonnies lead it 2-0. Uh, Adams with the ball, hands it to Dion. Dion right down the lane for the dunk. And finally, somebody got a ball to go through. Give it to Denzel. Greg, Denzel back to Marcus. Three on the way is good. There's one. Polsley hits the three. The Bonnies up 11-7. Ten seconds on the shot clock. Polsley. Will get the ball inside the Dion for the dunk. The alley oop as they go behind the zone for the score. You don't see that much by St. Bonaventure, but a good read by Posley. Great pass by Posley to Dion Wright. Ball against uh, Larson. Going to take the fall away jumper. Knocks it down again at the shot clock. Adams two for two to start the second half, and the body's hit by 11. Into Tyson, who gives it back to Marcus. Marcus going baseline, goes around the basket and scores. Oh, some English on that shot. Going off down the floor, goes up and dunks. And the body's up by nine. <laughs> a soft dunk, but a dunk nonetheless. The sideline, and Jay Adams comes away with it, goes up for the shot, puts it up, and in! Adams with a big basket. Got the ball at the top of the key, goes right side to Adams. Jay for three. Good! Adams heating up for the bodies, and it's 51-38. 3.42. Adams brings the ball to the left side. Still with the ball, he'll go for the basket, reverse layup, up and in! Wow. What a drive by Jay Adams! Posley will get the ball in to Jay Adams. Adams will bring it over the timeline, and George Washington calls off the dogs, and the bodies get a huge win! In front of a huge crowd here. Uh, Final score. Win. St. Bonaventure 64, George Washington 57. The Bonnies are 9-3 in the conference, and that puts them solidly in fourth place in the conference. And boy, what a great home win for the Bonnies. And, uh, you know, they earned it, Gary. They really played hard on the ball. Game, and everybody knew it was going to be a, a big game. You know, they're, they're a team that's you know, one of the elite teams in this league. Um, you know, our guys had never beaten them before. Um, so it was it was it was a big game. There were a game behind us. Um, it was a home game. It was a homecoming. Um, and, and I thought we it wasn't a pretty game offensively, but I think I thought our guys couldn't have played harder. Um, the effort was incredible. Um, the way we defended and, and, and I've been saying it all year. Everybody talks about you know, how good an offense we have and so forth. And I've said it from day one. You win in this league by playing defense. Um, you know, being tough physically and mentally. And we didn't play offense well at all. You know, Jay hit some shots, and thankfully so. Uh, we made plays when we needed to make plays offensively. But we won this game um, because we defended the best that we've, de we've defended all year. Um, we were physical, um, and we made, we made plays um, when, we, when we needed to. Our offense wasn't affected. Um, uh, excuse me, our defense wasn't affected by our offense, um, and our guys showed great character. And uh, just proud of our effort and proud of our crowd. Um, it was a great day. Yeah, it, it gives you goosebumps. It, it's um, this place, and one of the reasons why I came here was because when I was at Xavier, they had crowds like this, and it was, it was unbelievable. And, you know, it just shows how important basketball is to the university. Um, and, we, you know, we might have won without them, um, but I know with them, we weren't going to lose. Um, it's just, and I told the kids, they, they need to appreciate this. You know, we, they might have been 100 games today, um, whatever. There was probably weren't four or five sellouts in this country, and, and, and we had one of them. And, um, you know, the, the kids have to appreciate the atmosphere that they play in because most, most programs, even in the Atlantic 10, they don't get crowds like this. This, this is a special place. The Riley Center is, a, is, a, a, is an unbelievable venue for college basketball when you have crowds like this. Um, and, and, you know, our goal was not was to not let them down. And um, well, I'm just proud of of the effort that I gave, uh, that the players gave, and, and the effort that, that our crowds gave us. Um, it was a great day.